Hey everybody, this is Mike Mitchell with Progressive Church Media, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use our freebie uh, around Black History Month, where we have developed some um, graphics here that you can post on social media. Now, we have uh, specifically formatted these uh, for Instagram, but you could also use them on Facebook or Twitter. So let me show you first of all what we've got. First of all, the images here you'll see, let me just kind of scroll through these. Let's start with the first one. What we've got here are kind of these really gorgeous um, African textiles that are just kind of floating, these pieces of fabric that are kind of floating through space and, and you can see, you know, they're kind of wrapping around and doing all kinds of cool things. This is part of an animation uh, that we're also going to be making available very soon for Black History Month. So these are just some kind of images from that animation. But you can see, you know, the I, I can't wait for people to see this, this animation. It's gorgeous. And, and I think uh, it's going to really enhance worship services, especially uh, anything you're doing specific for Black History Month. But what we've done here is we've created some um, Instagram templates and we're doing this in good old PowerPoint. Um, I always try to do things in PowerPoint because I know that that is software that pretty much everybody has access to. Not everybody always has Photoshop and that kind of thing. So these are formatted in the square format that uh, Instagram likes. And for each one of these, you'll see in this template, we've, we've got three of these that we're giving to you. So here's the first one. Here is the second one. And then here is the third one. And what we've done, let me go back to the first one. We've just kind of plopped in here um, some some African proverbs that we found that you know we thought might be kind of a neat thing. So the idea would be uh, one way you could use these is to, you know, maybe every day post a different African proverb as part of your celebration of Black History Month. So we're giving you a couple here just to kind of help you get started. Um, I love this one. In the moment of crisis, the wise build bridges and the foolish build dams. Somehow seems very appropriate for the times we're living in. I'll go on to the next one. A man who uses force is afraid of reasoning. That's a, a proverb from Kenya. And uh, the final one, to get lost, is to learn the way. So you could obviously change these to anything that you wanted. Just select that and change the type. Now, one quick thing that you might want to do with these, if you want to use these as they are, is you might want to add in your church logo or other information um, just to kind of personalize this a little bit. So I'm going to add in, uh, just as an example here, the um, logo for my church that I attend, which is Virginia Highland Church in Atlanta. So I'm going to add that in. So I'm going to come up here to the insert menu. I'm going to come down here to picture, go uh, picture from file. And I, let me scoot this over a little bit. I've got our logo right here. So let me grab it and we're going to bring it in. And so I might want to put it, for example, down here in this corner. Now, one of the things I might want to do while I've got it highlighted, I'm holding down the shift key on my um, uh, keyboard. And while I'm holding that down, I'm going to grab this little square right up here in the corner. That's just going to let me scale that up a little bit. And the reason I'm holding down the shift key while I do that is it keeps the proportions so it doesn't distort the logo at all. So, you know, I may just want to scale that up a little bit. And there we go. And then maybe, you know, I, if I want to, I could take this and I could do the same thing on this one and on this one. Let's pretend though that we've got all that done and so we've got these exactly how we want it. Here's what you're going to want to do. So these are right now in a PowerPoint slide format which uh, you can't directly post to, to um, you know Instagram or Facebook or anything like that. So we need to, to generate graphics from this 
really, really easy. I'm going to come up here to the File menu. I'm going to come down here to Export. And the trick here, I, I'm just going to put these out here on my desktop. But the trick here is right here where it says File Format to post on social media, whether it's Twitter or Facebook or Instagram or, or Snapchat or anything else, you want to choose from these uh, file formats here either JPEG or PNG. One of those two are going to be accepted by pretty much any online platform. I'm going to pick PNG. And now the other crucial thing I need to decide is, do I want to save every slide? Meaning I've probably made some changes and done some things to all the slides. Or do I want to save only the current slide? So in this case, it would be the one that I've got highlighted, which I can see right there. I, I want to say every slide, and then I would click on export and that would do the trick. And so if I did that, then I would have those graphic images. Um, I would be able to uh, grab them and, and use them. Let me show you what that would actually look like. So I have got them all right here. So I've exported them. And so let me just kind of bring this up. And so there we go. Let me see if I can make that a little bit there we can so it's, you can see it better so then I could easily post that image on social media so I hope this quick little tutorial helps um, and and if you do some cool things with these um, images to celebrate Black History Month I would love to see what you do